For the first time ever, the U.S. recorded more than 1 million new COVID-19 cases in a single day. Now, no. in, o in Oklahoma, the number of new cases reported on Tuesday was more than 4,000. News on 6's Johnny Resendez is live with the update on this. Johnny. Well, guys, Oklahoma health experts say the concern right now is that the infection rate is going to keep getting more and more bigger because of the amount of people that are coming back from the holidays. Now, the state health department says Omicron has been the dominant strain here in Oklahoma. Experts say data from the public health lab shows Omicron makes up 57% of cases from over the holidays. The remaining cases were the Delta variant. Doctors say they're still seeing a higher percentage of unvaccinated children get hospitalized with the Omicron variant. And one thing that we've learned from both the uh, UK and uh, South Africa is that, you know, these variants are mutating to find a population that's most susceptible. And unfortunately, uh, there are, you know, our children uh, are uh, that susceptible group. And on Tuesday, St. Francis reported nine kids in their hospital with COVID-19. Right now, children five and older can get the vaccine, and those 12 and over are authorized to get a booster. The state health department says less than 7% of the kids between ages of 5 and 11 are fully vaccinated in Oklahoma. Reporting live in Tulsa, Johnny Resendez, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.